hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you how to configure SMTP Gmail account and send emails successfully in ASP.NET MVC file for this example I'm creating a new project file new project I'm choosing ASP.NET web application .NET framework the version 4.6.1 and the project name is MVC Gmail okay from the template section I'm choosing MVC 4 click OK after creating the MVC Gmail project successfully let's open the solution explorer right click the models add class the class name I'm giving Gmail add I'm creating a public properties in this Gmail class public string to get set copy second property is from the third one is a subject and the fourth one is a body after creating the properties in gmail model class open the solution explorer expand the views folder in the home folder i'm deleting this one this is a default home folder and as well as the controllers expand that I'm deleting the home controller also delete ok after deleting the default view and controller I'm creating a new controller add controller I'm choosing MVC5 controller empty add the controller name is email setup controller add now here we got a newly created email setup controller the first thing I'm importing the namespaces the first one is using MVC Gmail the project name dot models class so I can access the models class properties in this controller after that if you want to send an email we need to namespace we need to add the namespaces also using system dot net using system dot net dot mail in the action result this is a get method I'm copying this one and I'll create a new HTTP POST method between the square brackets HTTP POST and the HTTP POST index method I'm accessing MVC Gmail project name dot models dot Gmail class I'm creating an object for this mail message class I'm creating an object for this mail message class mail message model dot from address which is our gmail id and model dot dot to mm dot subject is equals to model dot subject mm dot body is equals to model dot body mm dot is body html is equals to false after creating the mail message objects smtp client class smtp is equals to new smtp client 
smtp.host which is the now in this host name smtp.gmail.com that's the host name of the gmail provider smtp.port number which is an integer 587 SMTP dot enable SSL certificate is true. Network credentials NC is equals to new network credential. Here I'm using my Gmail account, which is chernpk at gmail dot com, and the password of your Gmail password. Just for the security reasons, I am not providing my password. But when I am sending the email, I will change into my real credentials. SMTP dot use default credentials. True. SMTP dot credentials is equals to NC object. Network credential objects. SMTP dot send method. Here I am writing the mail message object. After sending an email, I want to display a message on the browser. So for that, I am using view bag dot message is equals to mail has been sent successfully. Now here friends model dot from address instead of instead of model dot from I'm adding my gmail id only turn click at gmail.com let's build a solution here build succeeded up to now we have done the coding part in the controller now we need the view page right click the index add view and the view name index leave it as it is the template empty the model class this gmail I'm not using any layout here add now we got an index view also here or come to the body section between the divs and using HTML dot begin form the first one takes the action name which is the index name the page name of the view page name which is the index and the controller name email setup form method dot post the object ENCQIP is equal to multi part slash form data. Just for the time consuming, I created already which I am pasting here. And this HTML code contains H1 and H2 tags and table with the name 2, subject, body, and one button control. And this span element, I want to display the message with green color. Now, in the TD, at HTML dot text box for model is equal to model dot to address copy this one and paste here in the second tilde instead of two I'm adding subject 
the last one is a body instead of two which is a body and text box for this one is a text box area for comma new between curly braces rows is equals to 15 comma and the column size is 25 that's it the designing part now the last step is we need to configure the controller in route.config file let's go to solution explorer expand the app underscore start route config.cs open it and notice here in the controller it's a home instead of home controller we need to write email setup email setup and the action which is a view page is index only this one go to index.cshtml let's build the solution Here, build succeed app. Let's run this application on Google Chrome. And here we got the output of that program. Before sending an email, let's check my Gmail account. I want to send an email to this Gmail account. The two addresses rnrupee.in at gmail.com hello this is test mail mvc email send now here we got a message mail has been sent successfully let's check my google account See here Charan 3K which have set up our Gmail account in MVC. Let's open this one. That's it. If you like this video, please leave your valuable comment, share this video and please subscribe my channel. Catch you on my upcoming videos.